Um, so Dr. Tom Cross, um, he's a sports physician here in Australia, um, which is how and why the, the bracing protocol is named after his surname. Um, they have developed this system where, yeah, they brace the knee uh, and it's not for everyone. Um, it, it certainly is now a, a patient, it's a patient by patient um, assessment. Um, what initially started out was let's just put everyone in the initial study. So the initial study was 80 patients and there was really no, apart from a few exclusion criteria like fracture or repairable muck, bucket handle tears of the meniscus or history of blood clotting and, and those kind of DBT kind of issues, um, all types of ACL tears were included in the study. Uh, what they found in that first 80 was a clear picture that there was a certain subtype of ACL tear that lended itself to healing better than, than others. And it seems to be the mid-substance tear where the ACL basically splits in, in the middle. So rather than detaching from the femoral attachment, it kind of tears right in the middle. And by bracing the knee for a month into 90 degrees, the belief and the thinking is that the two damaged stumps will come closer together, a scar and a bridge will form between the two stumps and that's where the healing occurs.